Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Obert Potato. Welcome back to the second series of Prison Architect. At the end of last episode, I was just remarking about how well everything was going. And, you know, everything is going pretty darn well. I cannot complain about anything at the moment. Um, which reminds me, we do need to put drains into, uh, into all these locations. Let's go and do that. Drains. All the way down here. I quite like this idea for a shower room. Uh, it sort of allows us to, you know, have a little bit more freedom. Um, we will need to provide a common room for the prisoners as well. That has uh, also become apparent to me. Um, what else? Solitary cells, yard, storage, office, visitation, common room. Common room, yeah, that's sort of what we want. We want a common room and we want a solitary area. Hmm, okay. What we will do now is we will start work on our... Well, we've got a holding cell here, so and we've got eight prisoners arriving in an hour. I think it would probably be prudent to start work on our cells up here. That would probably be the best course of action. So let's go and do that, and uh, we'll quickly hurry through this and get eight cells built. Whoa. Eight cells built, so we can house all our prisoners. Oh, yeah, appropriately, um, when they arrive. Nice. So that's two, four, six, eight, ten. Okay, so ten. That's that's good enough. Let's designate all those cells as cells, and we still need to stick a bed and a toilet in them all. But that shouldn't be too much of a challenge. Uh, that was a mistake. Good. Now, you guys get to that. And I will start placing beds in all of these cells. Nice, let's get them all uniform. And proper. And let's get the toilets in place as well. Nice, there we go. Um, we also do need jail doors, of course. How could I forget? Perfect. So, hopefully, these guys will... Uh, the guards will take them into the holding cell while their cells are being prepared. In the meantime, let's pause and let's have a little think about our admin block up here. Now, we really don't need it to be that big. But at the same time, the stuff that we got going last, or that we had going last episode, was uh, was seriously awesome. Every office needs to be what is it? Four by four? Is it five by five? Uh, four by four. Okay, so we need four by four office, which is easy enough to do. That's four by four. So that means we need to move this entire section down by one. Is that is that what I mean? I think it might be. There we go. So, no. No, we need to move this down by two. Yes, to get walls. We'll have a walkway of one, and then we will have walls as well. Okay, so, down here. Yeah. Okay. Is that what I mean? Because we had a really great system last episode. Well, not last episode. Last last season. Um, and then we'll get the walls tools out, and put in place the walls again. Okay, so yeah, we had a system like this, and this really worked for us. I thought it was awesome how uh, how we managed to fit the office block into like this sort of size. We only need like four office blocks anyway, but we will need an area for the dogs and the armed guards. So perhaps putting the offices at the front and then expanding it backwards as time goes on, as we need, you know, armed guards, dogs, etc., etc. That would probably be the best idea. So let's do that, actually. Let's build the first half of the... In fact, no, we can't build it up there, can we? That's really annoying. Uh, okay, so we're going to have to build it one more, but we're only going to build this much. Yeah, let's only build a small little small little thing at the moment. Okay, so hopefully you've not been lost by my uh, my, my very erratic clicking and explanations of, of 
what's going to happen. Um, but I think it's understandable. Um, so I hope you do too. But let's put in place a staff door here. Yeah, right in the very middle. That's there. And we'll let the workers get to uh, get to work. Pipes. Yes, we need pipes. I'm aware of this. We need pipes. Let's get pipes running through the walls. That's a little bit extra that we don't need. And then we will have it running there. You know, I could, you know, do one and save save two bucks a pipe, but you know, we're not going to. We're just gonna stick all the pipes in place because why not? Let's stick in excess infrastructure if it saves us some time. That's nice. Okay. Got any of these cells up and running yet? Not quite, but we're working on it. Working over here as well. Everybody's very hard at work. Prisoners are in their holding cell. Some are, anyway. Why are you over here? You're a snitch. Ah, so you're probably going to get beaten up and killed. Great. Something else to look out for as, uh, as time goes on. So, is this finished? Is this building done? It is. Let's uh, let's stick in place the infrastructure that allows us to uh, to build an office. Office, office, office. There we go. And we're of course making it a four by four room. There we go. That's an office there as well. And let's continue and just finish off the uh, the brick walls. We are going to get rid of planning in this half, but we're going to. We're going to keep this area just because, you know, we like to be reminded of, of what we're doing. What do we need for an office? We need an office desk chair, chair, filing cabinet, and it needs to be indoors. Well, we've already satisfied that indoors condition. So, presumably, we can just go ahead and uh, and finish off what else we need. We're just going to mirror it straight across because why not? Um, what else? Office desk. Yep. There, there, and we need an office chair as well. I think that's an office. I think it's just a normal chair that we need. Yeah, it is a normal chair. Okay, that's good. So that's two offices, which means we can finally employ our warden. Yep. There we go. Our warden is now in place, which means we can start off on uh, the bureaucracy train. Not that button. The uh, the bureaucracy train. Have we completed this admin center achievement yet? No, we need to unlock finance through bureaucracy. So let's go and do that. Let's start our warden off on finance. Why not? And uh, it's mealtime, guys, so uh, eat up, enjoy. Hopefully we'll feed all the prisoners. That's definitely the, uh, the intention. Hopefully it works. And everybody's off for uh, yard time. Now, what we can do in the yard that we don't have to do, but uh, but we will, is put some phone booths. Let's put some phone booths and some weight benches. And they're only a hundred bucks anyway, so we might as well. And we're also going to put some toilets in here. Two lit, two rows of toilets. So uh, it'll give people a little, you know, a little respite if they have uh, weak bladders. So it seems that uh, that phone booths are in high demand. Nice, that's good. As long as uh, as long as they're doing something, they're staying out of mischief. We've hired a warden. Uh, we haven't connected that area with power yet, so uh, that's something that we're definitely gonna do. That'll do, I'm presuming. Um, what's next? Well, first off, that's getting sold because uh, we don't need it, and we get a hundred bucks for it, which is nice. But we do need to connect these toilets to uh, to the mains. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Looks like the shower is working just as intended. That's such a cool feature. I really like it. I'm uh, I'm very proud that you know managed to think up such a such an ingenious system. Finance the bureaucracy is coming along. Hire an accountant. Th th we will be able to do that as soon as we, uh, as soon as we unlock finance the bureaucracy. 
In the meantime, let's look at accepting another grant. We've put it on pause just so we can do that. Um, health and well-being. Hmm, didn't think about a medical ward. How would we incorporate that? Perhaps that could be an external building up next to the uh, admin place. That could work. Prison maintenance. Let's do this next. Yeah, let's unlock that next. Unlock maintenance through bureaucracy, cleaning, groundskeeping, hire a foreman, hire at least two janitors and a gardener. Okay, that's no problem. So all of this stuff is going to happen eventually. Um, in the meantime, we can start thinking about perhaps... I don't know. Well, this is going to be next on the agenda, for sure. Um, we can at last hire an accountant. Let's do that. I don't know why it doesn't allow us to place it over there, but it doesn't. Whatever. Um, and we get 5,000 grant completion for that. So, 5,000 grant payment. Payment uh, payment to us for completing that grant. I don't even know what I was trying to say, was trying to say then. It does not make sense. Um, we can probably thinking about probably thinking about building. We can probably think about building some additional infrastructure for our uh, our new prisoners that are going to be coming very very shortly indeed. And we can start planning out exactly what we're going to do in regards to uh, new cell arrangements. Nice. Okay. And uh, and this should allow us to have a lot more prisoners and perhaps keep the uh, keep the next batch and the batch after that happy in nice cozy cells. Now, yeah, this shouldn't be a problem. This has actually gone uh, gone remarkably well so far, like so well. I can't even complain about anything. It's just gone that well. Not there, there, yeah. We of course don't have the clone tool yet because we haven't unlocked it through the bureauc bureaucracy menu. So it's uh, it takes us a little while to build our cells, but you know, we're managing, we're coping, and uh, and it's the whole prison's coming along very very nicely. Good, good, good. Nice. How's our power looking? Yeah, our power looking. Our power is looking all right. Um, it's a good thing we did get those capacitors. Um, it did cost us a little bit of money, but you know, hey ho, we did it. Are you finished building all these uh, these toilets and stuff? Good. I'm glad you are. Bureaucracy. We've almost finished maintenance. Now. If I'm not mistaken, when we hire a foreman, we will need to give him an office. And I don't think I am mistaken. I think we genuinely have to give him an office. Let's do that. 4x4. Four four. Um, let's build another office over here. I think we need it. I think we need it for the psychologist. Yeah, we do. We do. Um, yeah, let's stick this up here. This up there and get rid of that there and then we'll stick all the stuff that you need to stick in an office and uh, and hire our uh, foreman and the chair as well nice it doesn't really matter where we stick it in the office as long as it happens you know um, we can hire the foreman nice good 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 psychologist uh, oh no now we can start researching groundskeeping and after that cleaning which will allow us to uh, complete this grant which is what we're after hire a janitor no hire two janitors and a gardener that will be uh, that'll be good because it means we'll get five grand out of completing that that grant which is uh, which is not too shabby have we put in place the infrastructure to deal with all these toilets no we haven't Yep, yeah, that's fine, and yeah, this is going over there like that. 480 bucks for some toilets, or for some infrastructure for some toilets, is, uh, it's not too bad. So, yeah. Now, we are going to leave these doors locked open for now, but we are going to close them. And if I don't close them, then please remind me in the comments to close them, because it is essential that we do just that. Um, because otherwise, everything just gets way too crazy, and, uh, and insane so 
that's not on the agenda. We don't want things to be crazy. We want things to be calm and nice and everybody happy and we all get on just dandy and, you know, have a happy life. So that's the plan at the moment. Now, that office is still empty. We will unlock it hopefully very soon indeed. What else can you unlock? A land expand land expansion, extra grant, bank loan, tax relief, um, education? Hmm. Yeah, let's, let's unlock you, and you, and you actually. Let's just spend all the money. Two escapes today, are you kidding me? Okay, we're, uh, we're keeping that door closed from now on. Forever. It's not even opening ever again. Tough luck, guys. We had two escapes. That's just not good enough. That is not good. Two escapes on our first... Four escapes? Beautiful. Beautiful. These guys are all in lockdown. That's just fantastic, isn't it? That's just great. That's not what we need. That's that's really not what we need. That's really not what we need in the second episode of, uh, of a brand new series. I'm afraid that's just not on, guys. That's just not on. Okay, so we uh, have unlocked groundskeeping, and that means we can hire a gardener. So we'll hire one gardener and satisfy that requirement. We just need two janitors now, and uh, we need to unlock cleaning through bureaucracy first before we can hire those two janitors. So, booyah, it's happening, guys. It's happening. It's all coming together. And I suppose, since we only have 12 prisoners, it means we can accept these 8 prisoners. So, it has actually worked, those 4 escapes have actually worked out for the better. It means we do have another 24 hours or so before we need to build some more cells. Which, you know what, I'm not complaining about. 24 hours is a nice long time, we can have a wee, have a wee think about how things are going to go. What I would like to do, however, is put a staff door in here. So that staff can get in and out of the kitchen without having to go through the whole sort of prison mishmashy system and whatever. Like, through here, out here, down here, whatever. You know? So hopefully, yeah, people are going to use this door now, which is exactly what we're after, you know? What are you doing, buddy? You're just wandering around. Come and, come and clean up this, the walls. They're all messy. You're not going to deal with that? No, it's not your remit. Didn't think so, buddy. You're, uh, you're not cool. Get back to work. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? I can't chastise you anymore if, if I don't see you. Here you are, of course. Jesus. Look at him. Just look at him. Wander around, doing absolutely nothing. Hmm. Oh, well. Oh, well. So much time and, you know, so little to do. Typical gardener. 79% completed this uh, this unlock cleaning through bureaucracy thingamajigger and after we've unlocked that we can hire two janitors that's exactly what we're looking to do because this place is getting messy even though it's only been open for I don't know three days day three we've been playing for 35 minutes and 32 seconds something like that let's go ahead come on just get just get it done buddy let's uh, let's hire some janitors ASAP boom one, two, two janitors down, 5,000 bucks for completing that. That's fantastic. Ladies and gentlemen, my name's been Obito Potato. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, then please like and subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye.